Miami Dolphins player Kenny Stills says he's receiving death threats after blasting the team owner for holding a fundraiser for Donald Trump. The wide receiver criticized Stephen Ross at first by retweeting the news with a picture of the billionaire's nonprofit dedicated to equality in sports, writing, You can't have a nonprofit with this mission statement, then open your doors to Trump. The player then discussed the matter with reporters after the Dolphins' Thursday night preseason game, saying, If you're going to associate with bad people, then people are going to know about it. I think there are ways you can support candidates without it being so public and without it being at your personal, private residence. I put it out there so everybody could see it. Stills also told reporters that he's received about five to 10 death threats since tweeting out his criticism earlier in the week. But the wide receiver speaking with CNN noted that despite the backlash, he's pushing forward. For me, I'm trying to lead by example. I'm trying to do the work that I feel like God has placed in my heart to do. If it comes with a little kickback, that's okay. As for Ross, the real estate investor defended his decision to host the fundraiser saying, I've known Donald Trump for 40 years. And while we agree on some issues, we strongly disagree on many others and I've never been bashful about expressing my opinions. Ross's other businesses, Equinox and SoulCycle, have also been under fire with numerous celebrities encouraging a boycott over his support of Trump, citing the president's racist tendencies and lack of action following two more devastating mass shootings. For more updates to the story, head over to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Maya Joy.